everyone. Good afternoon and welcome to CT Style. I'm Teresa Dufour. It is Wednesday, February 12th, 2020. That means two days until Valentine's Day and we are making the perfect dish today over in the kitchen. It is Chateaubriand for two by Chef Attilio Marini from the Cast Iron Chef Chop House and Oyster Bar. He said there are still a couple of reservations, but you're going to have to go early or late, but he's coming up shortly. Plus, we are chatting with psychic and certified personal trainer Nicole Fevrier Davis, who tells us what your waistline says about you. And February is Heart Health Awareness Month, so some information about that as well. But first, let's get into today's dish. It is all presented by Stone Academy. We have a new best in show. Siba, the standard poodle, took home top honors at the 144th Westminster Kennel Club Dog Show. She was having a great day. Look at her hair. That is fantastic. She was chosen from seven finalists. That included a Whippet, a Havanese, a Shetland Sheepdog, and a Golden Retriever who happened to be the audience favorite. Now, this is the first time a standard poodle has taken home top honors since 1991. Nearly 3,000 dogs from around the world entered the competition. Well, the happiest place on earth is starting to hurt some pockets. Ticket prices are going up at both Disneyland and Walt Disney World as Disney prepares to open its Marvel Avengers campus in Anaheim. Disney says annual passes are going up between 4 and 8 percent depending on the plan and some day passes will cost, wait for it, $200 a ticket. Full pricing for Disney parks in Orlando and California can be found on the parks websites. Well, this is a unique story, a new kind of store is opening up in Norwalk, and customers are sure to find something they like. Amazon Four Star is opening at the Sono Collection in Norwalk. It's happening today. Every product in the store is rated four stars and above by Amazon customers. That means shelves are filled with all kinds of devices, books, kitchen appliances, and even board games. There will also be a stand for items trending around the Northeast. <laughs> 